The mental health conditions of asylum seekers and refugees trapped on Nauru is absolutely devastating. Many children suffering traumatic withdrawal sim syndrome exist in a semi-comatose state, unable to eat, drink and talk. We were seeing suicide attempts in children as young as nine years old. Seeing that level of deterioration in the children uh, was really quite horrific. Virtually every patient I met expressed current intense suicidal ideation and many had recent self-harm or suicide attempts. The word I heard most often in my own therapy sessions with patients was destroyed. I heard it in their words and I saw it in their eyes. While many asylum seekers and refugees on Nauru have experienced trauma in their countries of origin, it is the Australian government's policy of indefinite offshore detention that has destroyed their resilience, shattered all hope and ultimately impacted their mental health.